bits to show you and I'll try and get through it as quick as possible. So we have got this Victoria and Albert teapot. It's really lovely, it's very very good condition. There's no chips and like it's got birdies on it. And it was a pound, as you can see, I've still not taken the label off. But isn't it cute? Um, yeah, so I just thought I'd, uh, I'd get that. And I looked it up on um, Google and I've looked it up on um, eBay and quite a lot of them have gone for £10 um, with a condition and it, it's beautiful. I absolutely loved it. So it's like, oh stunning so yeah little teapot victoria in albert so i'm gonna try and sell that for 10 pound in the new year i've got this little um field mouse whimsy uh, made, my, made by wade um they are going for about three four pound on ebay and i got him for a pound it is um you can feel the where it's been i don't know taken off it's so beautiful I love the colours and I thought my granny would like this but I actually looked at the price and I got it for 99p and they're going for 10 20 pound so I'm sorry granny but you have to have slippers locks for Christmas <laughs> but now I've got this Bell's um, um, whiskey bottle it doesn't have the top on it so it's not going for it probably won't go for much but it's in really good condition considering the conditions of other ones on um other ones on ebay so yeah it's got all the gold plating still on all around it it's none of it's chipped the only thing that is that isn't in is the bum on the top but it's a bell's whiskey bottle and it's made by wade just like the other one but it's not as engraved and i'm probably going to put that on for seven pound now this one caught my eye and i, I love art deco so this caught my eye. It's all like a little sugar pot. It's in amazing condition. There's no chips, there's no cracks, especially for its age in its 1970s, 60s, 70s. Um, and they're going, there's one going in uh, that's sold for £20 and it's in this condition. So I'm going to put it on at 20 in the new year. This um, Rob Roy, all in one. It is a boys, a lot of, obviously, People didn't have, um, they didn't, in the 60s, 70s this is, made in the 60s, 70s, it's still got all the buttons and the buttons at the back, um, that was 50p, um, so yeah, I'm not sure how much I'm going to put that on for, maybe six, seven. A bundle of baby clothes, I don't think you'd really be interested to be honest, they're all different, they're all different baby baby stuff um Marx's next um M and Co and a handmade cardigan all that was three pound got some Clark's little shoes they are so cute they are four they are a three F and they need a good clean but not bad for fifty P <laughs> got this um, tapestry set or cross stitch whatever you like to call it it was 3 99 I actually bought it for myself uh, to do throughout the year for, to, for Christmas next year but <laughs> I didn't realise the price of going at and because it's brand new with all the threads they are going for £25 so that's going to go on um, at 20 with postage Same. We have a new dolly, um, it, she's my first dolly, um, she is by Lara Du or Jo, John John, read John John or something like that, she's all crackly, crack, crackly heart, she's just so cute, she'd be perfect for a pram, um, I bought it for 50p and she's going for £10 on eBay, she needs a good wash but I think I might put her on for 10 and see how it goes. Minnie Mouse is, we've got a little Minnie Mouse, she's from the original Disney store, she's like the dolly for, she's perfect for a new new baby um, and I got it for 33 pence and she 
is going on eBay for around 10 to 7 7 to 10 or 10 to 7 pound um, so I might put her on the uh, 10 pound and then reduce her we've got this Shopkins cushion it was made in 2017 I think Good condition I gave it a good wipe down some are go it's very very up and down with this Shopkins um, some are going for 7 some are going for 5 some have gone for 50p uh, yeah 50p it's just a bracket so I'm going to put this on at 5 uh, girl spotted this in the charity shop the other day and I thought oh, I've seen it on one of somebody's um, hauls they did in a charity shop and I can't remember what he's called but I'll link him down below if I remember what he's called and I got the Aldi van um, obviously it'll be upside down for you like that it's massive it'd be great as a draft excluder <laughs> it's underneath and then if you look that way upside down on this side <laughs> But well, anyway, um, I got it for 33 pence and they're going for 15 on um, eBay. So I'm just going to put it on at 15 and see how we bargain. He is from um, Tola um, and, or to, to, Tola um, and I've never, I've never had him before. I've never seen them before and that's because they're American and um, it's, it does got a rattle in his thingy and yeah I got him for 33 pence and they're going second hand not in this country in America mainly um, for $20 so I'm just going to put him on for £20 and see how I get on but I absolutely love him he's so cute perfect century for a little baby um, and it's yeah it's lovely I think it's ace so a good buy there 20 20 pound hopefully the last one i've got is this owl it's by Le early learning center it's got all these like shapes and spinny things inside little mirror chewy thing it's hardly been used you can tell it's such a good condition a little crispy um little thing on the top of his head and he was 34 pence and He's going for 10. Mo right, I've got these roller boots. These are for a little person. These are between size 10 and size 13. Um, so these are definitely for a little boy or a little girl. Um, I will be selling these next year. They are too small for my son. Because I would have given them to my boy, but they're way too small for him. Um, so yeah, I'm going to give them to, to see if I can sell them. I got them for £1.50. So hopefully, I've not I've done any research, but no fear, I've heard about them and they're quite, they go for quite a lot. So I'm going to put them on at 20 and see how I get on. Uh, but I'm not putting any free postage on. People will have to pay for their own postage from now on. Um, it's not going to happen, I'm afraid. <laughs> so much for watching and I'll see you tomorrow. Take care. Bye everyone.